Hi, I'm Pippa. I work with Northwest Local Land Services. And uh, we're out here today at a field day looking at the Hurusia trial site, where 20 trial sites have been set up to, uh, I guess, uh, look at the various efficiencies of chemicals um, and, and at the various times of years that they've been sprayed. So looking at which chemicals are more effective in summer and which ones are more effective in winter. Uh, the trial came about due to interest from landholders and local government and consultants. Uh, Hrusia cactus is a very big problem in the northern part of the Northwest Local Land Services area and so we're trying to engage the public best we can um, and inform them through this trial site. So we've had some really good results to date and I think we'll get some more really good results in the future. So these trials are being uh paid for by the local land services, Northwest Local Land Services. And we're, uh, what the idea of it is that we have quite a few chemicals that work at some times of the year, and they're no good in other times of the year. We're looking at the right sort of chemical to use for each month in the year so that we can deal with the Carissia properly. Currently there are a lot of chemicals on the market that are registered for Carissia cactus, but they, we do need, what we're trying to do with the trials is work out which time of the year these chemicals should be applied because uh, you know, what works well in the summertime is no good in the winter and vice versa. So we have, uh, that's the idea of the trials. We started with 40 different plots, 10 different chemicals applied four times and we've ended up with an extra 21 since uh, input from local landholders and Shire Council, people that all have their pet chemical to use. So we've, we've laid them all out here so that everybody can come along and compare. You can read the numbers on the, on the uh, pegs in front of the plant and they can compare what's going on they can, and uh, hopefully go away with the right idea of what chemical to use. So these trials started in March uh, last year, in 2015, and uh, they will continue and for two years and at the end of the two years surely then we know which chemicals we can trust when we're using them on Hericea. Well I've been spraying Hericea for about 10 years and used a variety of chemicals so I'm very interested in these trials that uh, have been set up by the local land services and I think it's great you know it's here where farmers can come and have a look at it and see what's going on and compare the different chemicals and the different brews and their successes and being sprayed at different times because it's not always possible to spray. Um, so uh, I'm really interested in this and the fact that there are sprays here that I can use in winter and also in times when they're not actively growing and that they might actually be more successful than using in times when it is really actively growing. I guess the, the best thing I've found with the the trial site one has been the location, it's been very accessible both for, for Queensland producers as well as New South Wales producers um, and being right on the roadside here everyone can come and go as they please and, and come and see the, the trial and the information whenever they, they like, it works in well. I think the other good thing about the, the trial has been looking at those different herbicides over a number of different seasons. People obviously have downtimes in, in their business at different times of year, and there seemed to be a real gap in information for winter spraying. Uh, so it's been really interesting today having a look at the, the results of some of the winter spraying, uh, and particularly where we've been getting some regrowth, so that, that probably indicates that, you know, we shouldn't be looking to use those in that particular time of year. Um, but yeah, they're, they're a good size trial and it's definitely been great to see the interest that's come from the producers as well as being able to incorporate their, their ideas into the trial.